So we are at a mineralized area here. You can see the Schistos rock. And this runs down and is exposed on the lower road as well, about 200 meters away. We're going to go down there after and take a sample. Uh, there's some calcopyrite in a lot of the float rocks down there, as well as in some of the bedrock peeking out of the bank like this. But up here, you can see the mineralization disseminated. All these rocks are mineralized. And we've taken samples from here before. This zone extends over about 25 meters and then goes over that way about 75 meters. Behind here there's an old trench, a 50 meter long trench. And over here we have a showing which we call the Battery Ridge Showing and it's sphalerite, pyrite and calcopyrite behind here. This is a little trench that's been hand dug in there by us. So if you take a look here at the bedrock, bedrock is exposed underneath all this silt and this is an area where I've actually popped a drill hole in and I have the core for this still. 4.25 meters of semi-massive to massive sulfides. And as you can see, it is all along here and exposed on the floor underneath all this right here, going over to about right here. So this is the drill hole that we got the deepest in, right there. These other ones were just little test holes. So we're gonna take a sample from this area in here. Chip sample along here, get in a bunch of nice looking samples to show you. So you can see this is the area I've been chipping pieces off. Right beside the drill hole. These are some of the samples here. Nice banding of swell right in there. Lots of mineralization in this outcrop here. So hammering more samples off. This is what we're looking at for most of these samples. So we've taken a chip sample from right about here all the way over to the front. This is a three and a half meter chip in semi-massive sulfides.
so this is the battery ridge showing behind here there is a 50 meter trench with disseminated sulfides running in all the schist running across this showing opposite direction and now we're gonna head down to the bottom road and get some samples from what we call the all metal copper showing so we're down at the all metal copper showing now the last battery ridge showing was up there and this is the same zone that cross cuts up there on the road pyrotization and all these and you have patches of calcopyrite in that and all along below here you find samples below the road and boulders that are mineralized so along the upper part of the road over here and on the lower part you can see all these boulders and there's some bedrock peeking out in about a hundred meter wide zone you can see all the samples contain pyrite and some of them also contain calcopyrite very light colored calcopyrite So what we want to do is grab a sample from this area, from some bedrock, and then we'll show some of the samples. So we've got a bunch of samples here now. You can see there's little patches of calcopyrite in some of these. The rest is pyrite. There are hundreds of boulders like this and about 100 meters of outcrop exposed on the upper side of the road. Hard to tell the difference, but that's calcopyrite right there. Pretty much everything else is pyrite. So we got another sample. We're done at this area. Thanks for watching. Take care.